Now, I do want to apologize. I just noticed while I was editing the last episode that I actually recorded in 720p instead of 1080p for that last one. So I do apologize about that slight lack of quality on the last episode. I had updated the firmware for my capture card and I reset all of my settings to default. So anyways, I do apologize about that, but we're back to full quality here. We're going to finish up the collection. We're going to get all the eavesdropping locations and also all the high points or whatever. Should be able to finish it in this episode and then we can move on to some of the challenges for the Moot Oil Rig DLC. Get some of these boxes, man. Get some money. And then I got my binoculars right here to get things started. It's not bad. A good 1600 bucks here. 1800 bucks. Nice. So I think that's actually where it all started. It was that party at the beginning of the game from that first cutscene. Alright, let me go here and then I'm just going to fast travel. I think that's the best way to do it. Just quickly make my way over there. Is this pervert in the porta potty with me? Uh uh, dude, this pervert's gonna burn. Hold up, let me get my, let me get my flamethrower here. He's got to burn for that, man. That was not appropriate, not at all. All right, this one was tricky to get to. Look at all these scabs, man. Nuclear explosion. That poor prisoner in the cage. She's still alive, man. Or he. What is that thing? It's a he. He can survive a nuclear blast, though. That's pretty pretty impressive. Survivor number eight. Nice. 2,000 bucks, almost. Let's take a look here. All right, so it looks like we got a delinquent here in the main character being forced into community service. That's all right. Nothing wrong with that. Let me cruise on through the harbor district to my next destination. Oh, am I going to have to climb that big building, dude? Please don't make me climb that thing. It looks awkward to climb. Damn it. Gonna have to do it. There's no way around it. Let's see what I can do. Alright, that was not bad at all, actually. It looked more intimidating than it was. Pretty sure that's the oil rig. Alright, let me take a look at the map here. What else... Got some eavesdropping, got some binoculars. I guess let me grab this one. Then I'll fast travel over there. Gotta use those fast travels to your advantage, man. Shave some minutes off the game. You're back in Troop Bushido headquarters. Alright, what have I got here? Gonna hijack a satellite. There it is. Probably gonna listen in on Troop Bushido, considering where I am. Must pledge to create traps and tools of highest quality because dependability. It, dependability is our friendability. I know the pledge, but in this situation, we can use the resources around us to reinforce this barricade. And I don't disagree. But we could venture out to a hardware store and scavenge some heavy-duty tools. That would also satisfy Rule 11. But that's an inefficient use of our resources when they're breaking through the barricade. Fall back! Fall back! <sighs> We're not done discussing this. I didn't get my debate badge for nothing, mister. Well, it sounds like American politics. 
Did we just eavesdrop on a presidential election debate? I think we might have. Let's head on over to the next one. Got another satellite to take care of. I love cruising through little Tokyo, man. It's a very chill place. And it's a lot more fun when I'm not worried about getting like all the toilet papers and the stinky shoes. Fizzy balloons. Granted, I'm still collecting something, but just moving from one point to another for the most part. Right. Man, look at that ice cream cone. That is a nice ice cream cone. Damn. Alright, what is here? Downtown. Let's get some eavesdropping going. Who am I gonna spy on today? Not really finding anything. That scab fortress up there. I always thought life would be different when I got out of the joint. But now that I'm out and running with the scabs, feels like I'm running back to my old life. I feel ya. Me, I've always wanted to kill like 50 guys. And now that I've killed way more than that, it's like an awesome dream. But I want to hold myself to a higher standard. Look at the world around us. Huge corporations, a society run by amoral, greed-driven maniacs. I mean, who are the real criminals here? We are, man. We are. Yeah, let's go do some murders. What a bunch of clowns, dude. Let's go take a look at the next thing. Got a couple of high points. A little bit to the north. Let me go grab those two real quick. Man, fizzy bots. I want nothing to do with them. I want to get out of here, man. Ah, damn it, I thought I could... Ah, I'm just being stubborn. I'll just use the umbrella. No problem. Alright. those walls look expensive. But I guess it's nothing compared to how much Fisco would lose if the rest of the world found out what happened here. Nice. And then, just to the east, I should find another one. Probably want to stay as high as I can and not fall down. Oh man, how am I going to get up there? Alright, I think I can do it right here. Alright, easy enough. Are these the guys I was spying on just a moment earlier? Might be. And let's see over here. Wonder what's out there. Maybe we'll find out in the sequel. Huh, maybe that's a hint for the next DLC. Maybe that's where I'm going. We'll have to see. I think in a couple of episodes we might get there, after I do the challenges in the next one. Fisco Campus, otherwise known as Reed Central Station. That was the site of that final mission. Alright, we got just a few more things left. That's Las Katrina's headquarters. And I got a satellite over here. Let's go do that. Oh my god, stupid fizzy bots. The downtown district is just so chaotic, man. It's a rough place. Do not kill. Leave alive. 
Alright, I'm gonna have to climb this building the old school way. I think I'm gonna have to manually do it. Alright, let's try it out. Like this. Just a couple inches at a time. There we go, that works. Let's hack some satellites. Sir, but space is rather tight. I can hardly fit in there as it is. Stevens. Ah, how about I load your clubs and then cling to the landing skids? Good lad. You've got a future at Fisco. Wow. These Fisco people, man. Just crazy. Poor intern. Alright, is it all the way down in that bridge? I'm not hanging around to find out. I'm getting eaten by OD here. I'm just gonna go that way, see what happens. Okay. Should have a satellite under me. And I am hanging on to life by a thread. Got like no life left. All right, who can I spy on today? Hey, we need a little Las Catrinas meeting here, girls. What's up? So those scabs we caught stealing supplies last night. You know the guy at the end? Oh, sure. The crybaby who was all begging for his life. And I just cut his legs off? Yeah. He dragged himself back to the scab base. And before he died, they gave him some painkillers. That medicine could have oh, gone to I'm the so children. Sorry, this guys. is a lesson for all of us. Never leave survivors! Damn, dude. Esperanza is ice cold. That chick is ice cold, man. Let me get out of here. Those scabs are threatening to kill me. Alright, maybe I can get some health here in the hospital. Alright, there we go. Now I am good. Let's go find some more stuff. This episode is like the NSA simulator. I'm just spying from people at a distance and listening in on their conversations. I'm telling you, NSA simulator 2015. Slowly climbing the hospital inch by inch. Such a barbaric technique to climb a building, but hey, it works. I'm not complaining. All right, let's check out this vantage point here. Should give a good view. I used to work concessions at the concert hall. Fifteen bucks for a plastic cup of shitty wine. Feeling cultured? Priceless. Back here in the roller coaster station. It's a pretty cool place. And here we go. Alright. What else have I got? got? Some binoculars right there. We can swim over there, no problem. I love burning OD with this weapon, even though the weapon sucks, it's still a lot of fun to use. Alright, let me see what I'm trying to get to here. I need to climb up this building. Alright, the hamburger girl. 
Pretty cool. I wish I had a giant girly hamburger balloon. Put it up in my front yard. Piss off the homeowner association. Should be another thing right around here. Alright, let's hack the satellite. Alright, what am I looking for here? I feel like we're near Fargarthia, so that's what I'm looking for. It's probably on the other side, it looks like. Slowly rotating the camera. Ah, right, there it is. These guys are pretty good at LARPing. They're pretty good at what they do, man. It's pretty nice dialogue. Alright, we got one satellite here, and then two vantage points. And I think those are the last three things that I need. So we should be finishing up here momentarily. Alright, let me see what I got. This is no, I thought this was the sewage area at first, but I'm on the other side of the map. I don't know what I'm talking about. Let's hack this satellite. There's some solid logic right there. Got all of those. So I just need this one and one more, and then I'll be done with the collectibles for good. Alright, and it looks like the last one is on the ship itself. So I'm assuming the next DLC is also going to have a set of its own collectibles. But I think this is it for the most part. I bet it's all the way at the top there. At the crow nest. That concert was intense. <laughs> this is funny. Walter would have hated Here it is, last binoculars. Oh, reference to Assassin's Creed over there. Hopefully I'll be able to play those on my channel one day, but for now, thanks for watching. And I'll catch you guys next time for the challenges for the Blue Oil Rig DLC.